This is a vintage V100 lemon drop. On Peter Green's guitar, he removed the clues and style tuners and put these sort of style ones on. To make it more authentic, what they've done is they've left the holes from having removed the old machine heads. I just think that's such a cool little touch. You may get this new guitar and you think, why has it got holes in the headstock? It's because it's made to look like it's had bits updated over time. Obviously, it's this one's relic, so it looks like it's played in. It looks like it's got a story. Now the spec says it has a Graftech nut, it stops you having problems with your G-string. No one likes having problems with their G-string. This is a really nice looking veneer because Peter Green's Les Paul, it had the pin striping through it, so that's pretty close for a guitar that's sort of around 400 quid. That is really, really cool. Just, just nice touches. It's just a nice guitar. Everything's nice, it weighs what it should, it doesn't neck dive, it's got good parts. I mean, these Grover tuners, these are my favorite, that's why I put them on every other guitar. And great sounding pickups, so you don't need to change the pickups. Like, what more could you want, like seriously?